Okay then, why won't you fight for gun control since guns are killing more babies than abortions are? First, this is a deflection from the topic of abortion, but I will entertain you. Do you know what the purpose of the Second Amendment is? In short, it is to protect the citizen from a tyrannical government and for self-defense. Then, let's say you get your way, you're able to ban guns and all of that. How will an innocent person without a gun, how will they be able to defend themselves against a criminal with a gun? Then, you think that just because something says it controls guns, it will actually have that outcome. After when you enact gun control or ban guns, it makes it easier for the criminals to commit crime. Did you know the majority of crimes are stopped because of a good guy with a gun? You would simply make it easier for a criminal to commit crime and kill people. However, there should be background checks and to make sure the person is stable. So I'll assume that's the argument you were making as well. Then you made the claim that guns are killing more babies than abortions are. Do you know how many abortions take place per year? And do you know how many deaths by a gun take place per year? Depending upon the source which you look at, about a hundred or so abortions take place per year. And about 60 million to 70 million unborn have been killed since Roe v. Wade. Do you know how many deaths per year happen because of a gun? Depending upon the source, it's about 20K or so. But you said babies. So that means the number is going to be smaller. Did you also know that in most statistics for gun deaths, they include suicide? And about 40 to 50% of gun deaths are by suicide. So now that number is even smaller. And then I include babies, it's going to be even smaller. I'm not minimizing the tragedy of babies being killed by a gun. But your claim is completely false and made up. Lastly, you tried to change the topic from abortion to the topic of guns, which is a red herring fallacy. How does gun deaths relate to abortion? It's two different topics. How does someone killing an innocent person with a gun prove that intentionally killing a healthy pregnancy and fetus is good or right or just? It doesn't. So in the end, your deflection to guns is completely irrelevant to the topic of abortion and does not prove it's good or right.